All right, welcome back to the stream, YouTube. Um, we're just finishing up in Final Fantasy. As you can see, I'm level 87. Um, and this is the last... The last class, Samurai, that we are going to be leveling up to 90. It's been a long grind. I've been, I've been working on leveling all of these characters up and finishing the story as well. Um, ever since, ah, uh, when did we start? It was before Chrissy. It was before Christmas. We're slowly getting there, though. One, one ability I'm really looking forward to unlocking, um, is this ability here. I have a feeling this is the, this is, like, the really cool hard-hitting slash that, uh, we saw in the job skill trailer for um Final Fantasy 14 Samurai. It looks really cool. So I'm I'm looking forward to I have to get to level 90 in order to unlock it. It's essentially my end game skill and I have a feeling I know how it works. I've already got a macro assigned for it. Cuz in all honesty it it doesn't need to be its own button. There's there's so many abilities in this game that do not need to be their own button and I'll show you why. So this ability here, Iki Iki Shoten, I don't know how to pronounce that. Right, this is what triggers uh, Ogi Namikiri ready. I'm pretty sure. So uh, I've I've read this. Grants um, Ogi Namikiri ready upon sex successfully land. Uh, God damn it! I can't even speak English. Um, <laughs> upon su successfully landing Iki Shoten. So when I use this, this ability here becomes ready. So I've just got a macro that essentially uses this ability. And then I have a feeling this is a, yeah, this is a weapon skill. Um, I don't know how this is going to work because there's also Kaishi Namikiri, which is essentially an enhanced version of like if we read this trigger the cooldown of weapon skills yada 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 i'm assuming grants a stack of meditation can be executed well can only be executed well under the effects of omi ogi namikiri i i don't know how this works yet I, i'll i'll work out how this works once i get to level 90 but, dude, if this is the ability that I think it is, it's fucking cool, man. I'm so looking forward to getting it. Uh, oh, you get two stacks of the Man, we're getting two stacks of everything, dude. Two stacks of True North, two stacks of this, which is really strong. Um, didn't I have more two stacks? No? Nunny? I thought I had more two stacks. Is that it? <laughs> and one of them is an ability that everyone gets. Fuck. Well, failed at that. Made myself look like an idiot. I've got three stacks of this over here. I don't know where I was thinking that I was getting a ton of stacks of something. It, it feels like a lot of classes have two of a certain ability, which is actually really nice because that means you don't need to use the skill straight away. I always, I always like when there's a there's two stacks of a, a skill that goes on cooldown because that means that like, let's say I use Soul Slice, right? Actually, you know what? We'll use... Um... We can't use that. Is there an ability? Dragoon? Do you have a two? You have two... Oh, do we have two Spine Shadow Dives now? I didn't even know that. Um, I suppose True North. We'll just use True North. Fuck it. So after the 40 second cooldown... If, if, if this is at zero, if we use True North again, right, it I will get one stack, but it will uh, go immediately back on cooldown, if that makes sense. So that that's optimal. That's that's optimizing. I, I don't have to use True North as soon as the cooldown finishes because it's already on cooldown. It's already giving me back another one at the most efficient way that it can. Life Surge is another one. I didn't even I didn't even see that one. Um Yeah, get, getting a lot of uh two charges. So two charges of this. What was the other one? Was there another one? 
Oh, hang on a second. What does Fuka look like? Hang on. Fuga. Now Fuga gets upgraded to Fuko. Okay. So what does it look like? I don't even remember what it looked like before. Shit. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Let's head over to Genshin. We did our we did our retainers. Yes. Okay. Let us uh, I'll boot up Genshin first, and I'll get the audio and everything set up. I might get the music going, I suppose. No, we won't do the music quite yet, because I don't, I don't really... I think it's against Terms of Service, actually, to have other music playing over the top of uh, while you're streaming Final Fantasy XIV, because Final Fantasy XIV, the... They're very into... Well, they, they have really good music, so they don't want people to see the game uh, in the way it's not intended to be played. And the way Final Fantasy XIV is intended to be played is with this really cool, badass music in the background. So I'm, I'm actually pretty sure it's against Terms of Service to stream it with other music over the top. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think it is. Which I'm fine with, by the way, because... In all honesty, the music in Final Fantasy XIV is fucking good, man. Okay, so now we will put music on. Okay, so you guys wouldn't have any games down just yet. Let me fix that. There we go, that should be fixed. All right. Uh, is the music on in-game? Oh, shit. Oh, shit, hang on. I need my controller. Uh, guess who's clearing about 15 inches of snow now? Oh shit, mate. Tell you what, you are you were on the money if you've got 15 inches of snow. Didn't you say that yesterday? That sounds like hell, dude. Hands would be freezing. Snow would be... I'm assuming snow is fairly heavy. Especially 15 inches of it. Fuck that. What is a special event? Oh, this is a web event. Right. We're not doing that. Um. Yeah, man, I've been getting really lazy with Genshin. This is something I realized today. I did not play Genshin at all today. I jumped on Final Fantasy and I started leveling Samurai. <laughs> and then I got to about... Uh, I got to about halfway through the day and I realized like, shit, I haven't condensed my resin. Went over to check on, on Genshin and my resin was capped out. Yeah, I'm not really doing that well at the moment in terms of, um, what's the right word? In terms of uh, efficiently using my resin. It's capping out a lot recently. And I blame Final Fantasy. There's no end to this. Direct gather. Oh no, boys. Oof. Oh no. Wait, what kind of daily is this? Oh, this is the mission. I'm not even doing a daily yet. Didn't even realize that. I totally forgot that we didn't do this yesterday. Ask, uh what we've done to offend you. Don't touch the temple. We're, we're rebuilding the temple nearby. In the middle of these mountains? Yeah, it belongs to... Oh, what's his name? What's the... What's the Adeptus' name? I can't even remember. Fuck. Pervases. Is that it? Is it Pervases? Oh, fuck. I can't remember. Probably said that hella wrong. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, I'm not being very efficient. Go back and tell the others to give the temple a wider berth. Yes. Yeah, as far as I'm concerned, you can rob people and stuff. Just don't take it from a Adeptus' um, place of worship. Oh, 
Keep up the faster. good fight, my treasure hoarder brothers. I mean, I'm not a bad person. What are you talking about? Let's finish up this quest and then we'll get into our dailies. Treasure hoarders about. I uh, tell him about the treasure hoarders. So they left, that's good. Anything else I can help you with? Thank you for your kindness, but you've already helped so much. Wouldn't be right. I'll help out more, mate. Wait, something about Sandbearer Wood. Do I have Sandbearer Wood? I do. Good. I tell you what, if I didn't have any, I wouldn't have known where the fuck to find it. Uh, have you seen the new game competitor for Genshin? Which one? I tell you what, now that you've said that, I totally forgot to play, um... What's it called? Blue Protocol? Is that out yet? I, I think Blue Protocol is supposed to be coming out sometime this year. I almost completely forgot about that game. Uh, hang on, did we finish the quest? Okay, we finished the quest. Alright. Dailies. Let's do this. Make it easier on ourselves. Um, are there new dailies in the new region? Seven Deadly Sins Origin. They just released a trailer. You know what? I haven't seen that. We'll watch it at the at the end of the stream, eh? I'll get it. I'll get it up on YouTube. Hello, my friend. There is no escape. Ring cutter. I don't know why I did that. I just wasted proccing my sacrificial sword. Look really cool. Well, Seven Deadly... I don't really, really know that much about Seven Deadly Sins. I've never played any of the games and I haven't watched the anime. But... I have been told a lot to watch it, so I'm assuming it's really good. If they're making a... I'm assuming it's an open world gacha game. If, if it's a Genshin competitor, it's got to be an open world... Open world character collector in some way. Otherwise, like, you know, it, it's the same argument of, you know, people saying like, oh, I'm going to quit Genshin for, what was that game called? Cookie, Cookie Kingdom or some fucking shit. I can't remember what that game was called. And I checked it out. And that game isn't anything like Genshin. Oh, you dumb bird. You know, the, the majority of Genshin's audience is not going to move over to Cookie, Cookie Run Kingdom, was it called? Like, they're looking for the Genshin experience, so... We'll have a look at this, um, Seven Deadly Sins Origin at the end. Any competition, as far as I'm concerned, is good for Genshin. Because... Think you can get away? As soon as Mihoyo, hopefully, as soon as Mihoyo start to get actual competition in terms of, uh... the Genshin player base, Hopefully they'll start to add more quality of life changes to the game. And that's that's only good for the players. Any kind of competition in the in the space is only good for the players. It's not good for the company itself. So you've piqued my interest. Definitely looking forward to seeing whatever this is. Agreed. Maybe they'll start listening to the player base. Yeah, the, like, here's the here's the big thing that I care about. I don't care about uh, everything that I whinge about. However, I feel like games, in order to keep people around and keep people happy in general, a game should respect your time. And I feel like Genshin doesn't really respect your time investment right now. You can go... For X amount of months, and I suppose this is with a lot of gacha games, you can go for X Time amount of months and get fuck all from the game. You know what I mean? Brace yourself. That's something that's making a lot of people burn out really quick. 
But then again, on the flip side, you can go one day and get complete god artifacts if you're just so lucky. You know? Wait, can I not pick that up while you're aggroed onto me, you son of a bitch? But, like, there's a ton of changes that need to come to the game, but they need to add something to keep people interested in the game. Because at the moment, it's just it's just repetitive. It's the same problem with Honkai. Honkai gets boring really quick, and really you only come back for the story. Um, because this you do exactly the same thing every single day. There's, there's so much potential with Honkai if they were to... In all honesty, they probably need to actually remake Honkai. Need to... I don't know whether you'd call it Honkai 4th, Honkai Impact 4th, or... Where's the last one? Is that it? Yeah, here it is. Oisu. Oh, hang on, I need to... Oh, damn it. I nearly teleported away. <laughs> They, they, they just need to give us something where, um, if, if you want to make the game grindy and keep people stuck around, at least make it so that we can, we can do something that, like, not necessarily waste our time, but yes, waste our time, if that makes sense. Actually, that probably doesn't make any sense. What I mean by waste time is there's two different ways of wasting time. One of them is grinding artifacts, which feels like shit. And the other one is doing like a deep dungeon where you spend like an hour doing it and you got fuck all for doing it, but the whole time you were doing it, you were having fun. That's the two different ways of wasting time. One of them is bad because you are wasting time to, to not have fun. And the other one is wasting time to have fun. You know what I mean? And the the fun version is time that you... Uh, sorry. Wasted time... Hang on. I can't remember what the, the analogy is. Time that you enjoyed wasting is not wasted. You know what I mean? So that we need something in the game that is the second version. Right now we only have oh, in Genshin is, is the first version. Except for the story. The story is probably the one thing where you enjoy wasting your time. You have a bunch of time during the day and you want to waste it on uh, progressing through the story. You don't necessarily want to waste your time grinding for artifacts. Some people might but the majority of people more than likely don't. They, they need to give us something like a horde mode. They need to give us something like a... Uh, like a, a, a massive co-op fight. I think a massive co-op fight would be really fun. A deep dungeon would be awesome because they, they were so close to having exactly what a deep dungeon is. What was it called? The Labyrinth? That, that Labyrinth was so close to being a proper deep dungeon. That would have been so cool. All they would have had to do was make it so that those rooms would randomize every every next floor that you went to and all of the enemies that spawned, they would all randomize and their stats would slowly increase over time. So each room would be different, but you'd just try to see how deep you can get. So you'd go to the next floor and the enemies would be a lot harder and then you get to the next floor, then you get to the next floor and then every five floors there's a boss maybe and each boss obviously gets progressively harder so the fifth floor boss will be you know pretty easy 10th floor boss ah, it's okay 15th floor that's pretty hard 20th floor oh shit this is getting pretty you know like i'm about to get one tapped here and then like the uh the 25th floor boss is just like well fuck if you don't have really good artifacts you're just dead love labyrinth warriors yeah they were so close to having that, that Labyrinth Warriors, I was so... Oh, what's the right word? Um, I, I, don't, I can't remember what the word is. I had a lot of positive feelings towards it. What's the word? Um, hopeful? No, nah, that's not it. I can't remember what the word is, but I, I was really looking forward to them doing something with Lab Labyrinth Warriors. Um, and I was kind of hoping that they were they were gauging how the community was going to react to it. And I'm pretty sure the majority of community, um, I know MTash didn't like it. 
but I'm pretty sure the majority of the community actually did like Labyrinth Warriors. So I was I was hoping that they were going to do something extra with it, but they didn't. Maybe they are. Maybe they've got something in the in the works. But I doubt it. Though that was ages ago now. Labyrinth Warriors was that two updates? Is that two updates ago, or am, am I am I crazy over here? Ad Astra. Thank you. It, for it feels like it was ages ago. Maybe in the ten year plan. Ad Astra. <sighs> I'm not, I'm not really optimistic about the, that's the right word, optimistic. Um, I, I'm not really optimistic about the 10 year plan because more than likely it's a 10 year plan where it's the, maj the majority of what's on the 10 year plan would be story because if the, if they were thinking about adding in something like Labyrinth Warriors and that's on the 10 year plan, what's the point? You know, why not just add something like that in now? Because people need that now in order to keep interested with the game. A lot of people are leaving. A lot of people are getting bored with the game and saying, you know what, there's other stuff out there. I'm going to go try the other stuff. I'm, I'm just sticking with the game at the moment. I don't plan on stopping playing Genshin. However, I am definitely falling off in, uh, in my efficiency. I, I, I've had capped resin a bunch of times this week. You know, whereas before, let's go back probably six months, I never would have capped my resin. If my resin was capped, I would have freaked out. I was like, oh shit, that's not very efficient. You know what I mean? I'm one of those people. Yeah, it, there's a lot of those people. Sub was one of them as well. Yeah, they, they they need something. I don't I don't know what it is. I think a horde mode would be really cool. Um, there's a lot of things that would be really cool. That we here's here's what I would do. Anything that essentially gives you nothing, but you actively want to sink time into. That's what we need. Not not everything. Like let's say a, a domain down here. Not everything has to give you a reward. This domain is nice because it gives me a reward, but if it had no reward, I wouldn't do it because it's actually not that fun. They need to they need to add something into the game where, like, let's say it's a do let's say there was a domain in the game that you would continue to do simply because, uh, like, you, like you're out of resin, but you still want to do that domain because of how fun it is. They need something like that in the game. They need it. Oh, damn it, I teleported here again. We're farming for Hootel. And I, I've been saying this for ages now, and I'm, I'm feeling a little bit like a, a broken record at this point. Um, like, I, I remember saying we need something like a deep dungeon or a horde mode or like a uh, endless waves or something like that. Or like a boss rush. A boss rush would be really cool, where you have to, uh, like, no healing. You have to go through, like, a labyrinth of bosses, one after the other, and there's no breaks in between them. You go from one boss directly to the next boss, and the bosses are, like, stupid fucking hard. That would be really cool as well. Even if they make it so that all of your artifact stats don't come into account. Like, let's say they make an event where they take away all of your artifact stats, um, well, actually, let's just say they just let you use trial characters and all the trial characters have certain stats. I think that would be pretty fun because that sort of event in terms of difficulty, making the event difficult, is very good for both free-to-play and whales. The whales won't beat the shit out of it so quickly and then go like, oh, that was easy. Wonder why it was so easy. Maybe it's because I spent so much money on the game and made the game easy for myself. And the free-to-play players won't feel like, holy shit, they scaled this so high because uh, Tectone has a busted as fuck C6, uh, like a bunch of C6 characters. You know what I mean? So they had to scale up the difficulty to this level. If they just uh, if they just have an event where you can only use the trial characters and then they just do like a boss rush, um, I think that'd be really cool. I, I would love that event. 
it, it would be probably awkward to to uh actually actually the way to do it would be to make it so that you have access to every single character in the game every single character is available as a trial character and then you just build a team out of them that'd be really cool We need, we need something like that. Maybe that's not the right uh, decision because then whales might think, well, what was the point of me spending money if I can't use my busted as fuck characters? But I'm going to be completely honest with you. The whales do it, do it to themselves. They run out of content because they paid to run out of content as far as I'm concerned. I'm sitting here still farming for artifacts. You know what I mean? None of my characters I would consider... Maybe Raiden, she's close to being... Actually, she she's within the realm of reason, being at the uh, at the peak of her abilities. She's getting really close to it. But the majority of my characters are kind of just slapped together. Stabilize. Uh, I gotta go clean the snow. Yeah. If you're streaming when I come back, yeah, no worries, man. I might be. Time to witness the power. Um, I don't know whether I'm gonna stream Final Fantasy, but. Yeah, take it easy, mate. I hope the snow's not not too hard to remove, but more than likely it will be. So good luck with that, mate. This is order. Freeze in place, boys. Stabilize. Rain outlines your face. Let me weave you first. Yeah, I, I don't want to hate on the whales at all. I don't want it to seem like I am. Um, now you shall perish. But I, I don't like hearing a single one of them. Like it doesn't matter who it is. If, if you're if you're making the comment that oh I'm, I've ran out of stuff to do in the game, as far as I'm concerned, you did it to yourself. Just don't don't pay to skip the game. The the whole point of playing the game is to play the game, not to pay to complete it. Rain outlines your fate. Like, it's not real life. The, the goal of real life is to try to pay to complete it. You know what I mean? But this is a video game. This is something you're meant to sink, sink your time into because you want to. And if sinking your time... It, like, if, if enjoying sinking your time requires you to offload, like, stupid amounts of money, I just don't think it's worth it. I don't understand why you would do that. Ooh, it's not that's definitely not the <laughs> the right main stat, but I'll take that. That's alright. What is this? This garbage. Yeah, this is alright. Do we level that up? I reckon we level that up right now. If this rolls into crit damage, that's a good piece. It's a good artifact. I don't know who I'm gonna put it on. As long as it doesn't ever roll into flat defense. Uh goblet and then. Or was it Crimson? It was Crimson, wasn't it? Yep. Come on, crit damage. Come on, crit damage. Crit damage, my boy. Come home. Oof. That is not all we were after. Solidified. Time for takeoff. Illusion shattered. Huh? Let me leave you a burst. Ah, uh, we didn't kill it. Shit. Alright, come on, group up. Let's go. We gotta, we gotta get rid of you. Oh, oh there we go. Excellent. I will have. I thought um, Xing Chao's ult ran out. Uh think you can get away. No my sword. Damn it. Time to act. Rain cutter. Huh? Shine down. Get down here, boy. Torn to oblivion. I'm trying to think of uh other things that they could add into into Genshin other than the, my my own uh, ooh, what's the right word? My own, uh, 
suggestions. So deep dungeon, horde mode, endless waves. Like endless wave is kind of like a horde mode. Um. Oh, what is that? Is that good? Uh, I might lock that. I don't think I don't think Hu Tao really needs energy recharge. She really wants to she really wants to hit as hard as she can. So HP, crit rate, crit damage, elemental mastery. And then like the fifth substat would be attack percentage if we could. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna level that piece. There is no escape. Brace yourself. Time for takeoff. What a fighting rain outlines. Um, I I think uh they Genshin does have a lot of cool puzzles. That could be somehow like a a daily or something like that. I don't know how. In all honesty. Okay, I only just touched him. Order guide. Stop. Boom. Stabilize. No, strip the shield. Strip. Don't you teleport? Oh, good boy. Body and mind. Yeah. Here we go. Illusion shattered. Ah, uh, we'll just use our auto attack. I'm not going to use Raiden's ult there. Um, yeah, puzzle domains I think would be really cool. Uh. Another another option would be like sea battle. Oh shit! Wait, how? I just did a bunch of leveling. Fuck. Okay, let's um. I really don't know what to do with my fucking artifacts, man. Let's um. What, what 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 have I been farming? I can't even remember what good artifacts I had. Let's go to the husk set, um, and we'll just look for here. Um, this is probably the best one. Defense, crit rate. This one. You reckon I go this one? It's HP though. Ah, uh, I really don't know which way. It's. Let's roll this. Roll into crit damage. Okay, I think we level this one up. As long as it only rolls into those two substats. Attack percent's all right, but. Okay. No, no HP. No HP. Okay. Crit rate. Nice. Um, after this, I'll have a look for any... Dude, we're putting a lot of experience into this. In all honesty, what it should do, eh, is it should prioritize four stars first. Um, to make the efficiency better. Attack percent. Yeah, that's alright. That's alright. Um, it's better than what's currently on, uh, Yoon Jin? What her name is? Shit. I think it's Yoon Jin. Yeah, Yoon Jin. Better than what's currently on her, so we're gonna we're gonna equip that. Defense. What was on her actually? This one. Um yeah, it's better than that. So now she's at a hundred percent. She's nearly at She's nearly at the required crit rate. So, in all honesty, what I could do... 
Wait a minute, how has she got so much crit rate? Oh, she's on deathmatch. Oh, I don't even need to build any more crit rate. I just put crit damage on her. Maybe, maybe we even go with... Do we go with defense? Is, is crit damage or defense percent main stat Creon better option? Yeah, bonus damage. This doesn't have any defense. Doesn't have any defense. Hmm, I don't think I... Ooh. Um... Hmm. Huh. That's, oh, it's Elemental Mastery, damn it. I always look at, like, crit rate, Elemental Mastery, crit damage, and I go, ooh, and then I remember Geo bonus damage. That is shit. We don't need Elemental Mastery as a dead stat. Um... Let's see. Let's see what... Oh, hang on, what's already on her? Let's just see what this rolls into. HP, nah, it's shit. Um, yeah, we still don't have crit damage, defense, elemental mastery. Damn it, we're after we're after defense, crit rate. Um, then what would the next stat be? She only scales off deep Like uh, her auto attack doesn't scale off defense. It scales off attack. I'm pretty sure. Um, but, so, like, every single attack stat you would instead want defense percent. That's what I'm, I'm going with. Uh, yeah, you would want defense percent, crit rate, and then energy recharge. That's realistically the best build for her, and then probably HP, in all honesty. Unless you want to use her as a, uh, like a... Like, she can carry her own even if she's only doing normal attacks. Then you'd build her attack percent. Um, yeah. Hmm. Um, yeah, so this, this is the one that's off. Shit. Yeah, I'm gonna need to go back into that other domain and farm out a crown for her. Because the other pieces are fine as as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, that's fine. Um, this is fine now, because it's got crit rate. It's rolled once into every single substat. That's fine. Uh, it's not best in slot, but it's fine. Could roll this. Oh, hang on, it doesn't have defense percent main stat, what am I thinking? Um, okay, so hang on, did we already check the, the mains? Yeah, so the, these are the stats that we got when we put that new artifact on. Damage, defense. Uh, it doesn't have any crit rate. I actually don't know how much crit rate I'm gonna get. Let's put this on it for now. Fuck it. So we'd probably end up with these sorts of stats. If we can get a crit damage uh, main stat Creon on the right set, on the husk set with crit rate, uh, and then crit rate rolls into. 
It rolls into crit rate uh, maybe twice, and we can get maybe 10% crit rate, and then all of the crit rate from uh, Deathmatch. I think she'd be good. I think she'd be pretty good. In all honesty. I suppose one thing that I'm not thinking about is if I'm ever going to take... Like, yeah, this was supposed to be Noel gear as well. This was actually supposed to be Noel gear as well. So that means Noel. Hang on a second. Noel, where are you, my girl? Shit. Yeah, shit. I don't have white blind at the moment, but white blind wouldn't fix the crit uh the crit rate issue and if we if we rely too much on deathmatch here hmm i suppose ultimately if we if we see a if we go back to the husk domain and we get a husk crown that's got crit rate crit damage defense percent artifacts then we'll build that for Noel. Uh, we'll build that as well for Noel. I'll try to see if, see what it rolls into, um, so that I can essentially take off the first four artifacts and put them onto Noel, and it will still work. Unless I can get a, if I can get a goblet, if I can get a goblet, then I can just pick and choose. You know what I mean? If I can get a really good goblet for, um... Time to act. With, uh, Geo bonus damage, defense, uh, crit rate, crit damage, and then probably energy recharge. Because Noel's gonna want energy recharge. Uh... Stabilize. Then I can pick the crown, which would probably be ideal, in all honesty. Shine down! Rain outlines your face. Know my soul! Rain cutter! Okay, just try and get rid of you, try and get rid of you. Group up, boys. Oh, no. Watch my enemies disappear in front of Raiden. Can we get rid of your shield too? Oh, damn it. Xing Chao ran out. Rain outlines your face. Know my sword. Time for takeoff. Aw, oh, damn it, it didn't... Fuck. Doesn't matter, I'm gonna strip that shield. This is order. I'm trying too hard, I don't know why I keep trying to fucking do that one thing. Alright, come on tree, give me something cool, man. was uh, not something cool. Okay. Venti, generate energy for yourself, please. There is no escape. Think you can get away? Body and okay. Rain outlines your King Charles gonna generate a bunch of energy. Kill you. Illusion shattered. Damn it, Raiden still doesn't have her ult. There we go. Come on. Xing Chou, kill it. Yes, good boy. Okay. Time for takeoff. We're not trying to Order do the Hydro Swirl there. Witness the power of the like, I knew that was going to fail. Oh, it didn't proc? Sacrificial. What are the odds of that? It's an 80% chance times two. It happens so often, man. It's fucking bullshit. I feel like I feel like 80% chance times two happens more often than you'd think it would. Elements mastery. Yeah. 
No, thank you. 44. So we got two more runs. In all honesty, I was thinking that I'll stream Final Fantasy tonight because this is going to be a short stream for... Fuck. I, uh, this is going to be a, st a short stream for Genshin. Would it gliding be faster? But... I don't know, I'm, I'm slowly getting a little bit of a headache behind my eye, so... I might have an early one tonight. Maybe it's all these flashing lights. There's a lot of effects going on. I will have order. Oof. Wait, he didn't kill either of them. Chong Lee, I thought you were stronger than that, mate. Okay. Shine down. Now you shall perish. Move over to your buddy. I should have killed you first, shouldn't I? He's already in prop. So everything was fine in the end. Fire Nation didn't attack. Come on, tree. It is time for cool artifacts. Apparently it's not. Oh. Come on. Me want progress. Stabilize. Ah, uh, we're gonna venti first. Time for takeoff. And then ride in. Body and brain cutter. Rain outlines your Okay. This is order. Oh, I didn't kill him. Come on, group up over here. What are you doing over there? Inazuma shines eternal. That's my boy. Good, that thing's dead. Hiya! Boom! Perfect timing. Think you can get away? Damn it, he's teleporting. Oh no, he just teleported into it. I don't have Xing Chao out. Oof. Now you shall perish. His aura activated and didn't do anything. Poor little bugger. Was that the last run? I think that was the last run. Either that or I'm, I definitely need sleep. Yes, that was the last run. Come on, this is the time. The bad shit. Yeah. Can't believe you've done this. I need to, one thing I really need to do, and I don't want to do it on stream because it's just boring shit. Um, is I, I gotta I gotta do the event. Just been playing so much so much Final Fantasy, man. But then again, I'm nearly at the end of my grind. I'm nearly at the end of my leveling grind. In Final Fantasy. And at the end of the leveling grind there's gonna be a whole new kind of grind. And that's getting and that's min-maxing all of my all of my stats, and I'm probably gonna work on my tanks first, in all honesty. Um, I'm thinking about switching to a tank main. I kind of, I kind of like the a lot of how the the tanks play. Uh, they they seem to be they seem to be it's not it's not necessarily like easy, but rather than having a billion different buttons to press in order to keep your combo going. Realistically, your tanks only need to press three buttons. So it's a lot more simplistic in, in terms of combat rotation, whereas uh, a lot of your abilities are more reactionary as opposed to... Uh, as opposed to... I have to filter this in. And this is something that's all, that, that does bother me on the American server because I'm Australian. Um, I don't have good ping, so 
enabling two abilities and this is something that they should say uh people who play final fantasy should say that you should be aiming to achieve is using two off global cooldowns in between every single global cooldown ability i can't do that i literally can't do that it, it, the the server lag does not allow for me to play that way if i try it slows down my actual cooldown so in between every single ability is an off off um so in between the every single global cooldown ability is an off global cooldown ability but i think that'll do it for me for tonight um what is this wait didn't i read this wait after you place the launch ship you can select uh, firework parameters ah oh, i still gotta do that yeah, that'll do it for me. Thank you for tuning into the stream. I really do appreciate it. And Raiden definitely appreciates it too. I wonder if... She Hang on a second. Oh, no. Oh, no, Raiden. Are you going to get a skin too? It's going to replace you? Oh. What are they going to... Hang on a second. What are they doing with Honkai? There's a ton of changes coming to Genshin. What about Honkai? Are they doing anything with that? I didn't even think about that. Dude, there are some fucking sexy chicks in Honkai. There are some real sexy looking characters in Honkai. Are they going to change them too? Or is it just Genshin because Genshin's more popular? Honkai's more fringe, you know? Not a lot of people... Uh, the people in the fringe of anime, uh, anime gacha games play Honkai. The mainstream play Genshin. So. Hmm. That'll be that'll be interesting. I hope they don't change anything in, in Honkai because Honkai doesn't doesn't need it. Stay away. Stay away, uh, Mihoyo. Don't touch anything. Anyway, like I said, thank you for tuning into the stream. Really do appreciate it. Uh, next stream will be. Wait a minute. Next stream will be Tuesday. Oh, damn. There's no stream tomorrow. Oh, well. Ah, uh, so we'll just have to wait till Tuesday, damn it. Anyway, um, until next time, YouTube. I'm definitely going to head straight off to sleep. Um, feeling, feeling a little bit lightheaded at the moment. So I'm going to get some well-needed rest. Until next time, YouTube. Catch us later. <laughs>